is rap the news. My people, hear, O Israel. God is not a man that he should lie, nor the son of man that he should repent. God has spoken, and he said, You, Hebrew Israelites, have an everlasting covenant. You, Hebrews, have an everlasting love. You, Hebrews, have an everlasting salvation, for it is written. For it is written. God said it, and it shall be done. Then God said, Malachi 3, 6, For I am the Lord, I change not. Therefore, you sons of Jacob, house of Israel, you Hebrews, you are not consumed by the fire of hell or destroyed. For I, the Lord, have spoken it, and I'm not changing. So if you got an everlasting salvation and an everlasting covenant, and an everlasting love from God. Why would you need Christ? Ooh, huh? Why would you need Christ? Proverbs 24, 21. My son, fear thou the Lord and do not associate with those who give in to change. What is a New Testament? Change. Right? What is the new covenant? Change. What is now you got to go through the sun? Change. Don't associate with people who give in to change. Right? Exodus 7, 16. And thou shalt say unto him, The Lord, God of the Hebrews, have sent me unto you today. The 1st of May, 2020. Saying, let my people go that they may serve me alone in the wilderness. You ain't in the wilderness serving Christ. None of the prophets serve Christ. Y'all didn't gave in to change. And y'all are off. Y'all deceived. Jesus is telling y'all y'all deceived. Matthew 6, 24 no man can serve two masters. How are y'all then saying, Yahweh by Shem, Yahweh Shai? How are you serving God in Christ? Because you're deceived. You have one Lord. God can't be Lord and Christ is Lord. You have one Lord, and that is God alone. For either you will hate one and love the other, or you will hold to the one and despise the other. Matthew 20, 28 tells every Christian that their belief is false. The Son of Man did not come to be served. So what y'all serving him for? What y'all serving Christ for if he didn't come to be served? Who are you talking to? The children of Israel. He came to serve, meaning that he's a servant. He ain't a God. He ain't the son. He is a servant of God. Because he didn't come by his own will, he said. He came by the will of God. Meaning, I am a servant, not a God, not the son of God. Y'all bought the pagan infiltration. He wasn't the son of God before. He never saved nobody before. Y'all gave in to change some new fangled doctrine. Luke 4, 8. But Jesus replied, it is written, Worship the Lord, let me lead you back to God. And you serve him only, alone. It can't be taken away. It cannot be taken away. I didn't come to be served. You worship the Lord, your God, and you serve him only. Why do they want to keep worshiping Christ? Received. And they gave into change. And do not associate yourselves. Get back up to it, baby. Come on, baby. Let's get back up to it. Fear the Lord your God and do not associate those 
or with those who gave in to change because I, the Lord, do not fucking change. Why in the fuck is y'all serving Christ? Somebody changed. You weren't serving Christ in Israel. There was no Baishim Yahweh Shai in Israel. The God of Israel sent me to say, serve him alone in the wilderness. Get out of the damn city. Because no man can serve two masters. I didn't come to be served. It is written, you only serve God. They get it. Oh, hard-headed ass heathens. Luke 22, 27. Who is more important, says Christ, the one who sits at the table or the one who serves? The one who sits at the table, of course, says Christ, but not here. For I am among you as one who serves. I am a servant. I am not important. The one who sits at the table is being served. He's saying you have more importance. Do y'all not have intellect? They don't, these Christians, they don't, huh? Let's keep going. Matthew 10, 24. The disciple is not above his master, nor the servant above his Lord. How did Christ then got all power and all authority? Y'all deceived. When did God give Christ authority before? A God that don't change and said, don't give in to change. Mm -hmm. Busted, huh? Mark 12, 29, and Jesus answered him, the first of all commandments is, hear, O Israel, the Lord, our God is one Lord. But what did he say? God is the master and no serving is above his Lord, nor equal to him. Who is like God, says God? No one. I created the heavens and the earth alone by myself, says God. He didn't need Jesus' help. He didn't need yours either. Zechariah 14, 9, And the Lord shall be king over the, all the earth and the end. In that day shall there be one Lord, as it was in the beginning, so shall it be in the end. And his name, one, Ekod in that fake Hebrew Israel language. And so let's do a recap, students. God don't change. Don't associate with people who gave in to change. You got an everlasting covenant, an everlasting salvation, and an everlasting love from God. You are blessed from the garden. Don't buy into that. You are sinners. When God made y'all asses upright, this is Rap the News.